Stockholm Arena. In Stockholm, a quick whistle will be another faceoff coming up in the Sweden zone. You're watching our continued coverage of the Toyota World Cup of Hockey, Sweden and the Czech Republic. Right now, if Sweden were to win this game or even get a tie, they would take over first place in the European pool with Finland being idle tonight. Off that draw, Slager, weak shot, stopped there and cleared out in one motion by Ragnarsson. Played forward and then lost there. Sweden getting it back and then they'll just dump it in. Long chase for it. Picked up by Caberlite. Flip out pass near side. Yager played it back. Not a good pass at all. Caberlite, the Toronto Maple Leafs recovers. Thomas Caberlet, excuse me, JP. Thomas Caberlet is excellent at moving the puck out of the zone, and that'll be big for the Czechs in this game. Because the Swedes are so good with the puck, especially in the offensive zone, guys like Caberlet and Hammerlick for the, the Czech defense, if they can move the puck up to the forwards, it'll be a huge uh, boost for them in playing against the Swedish team. Nielsen just took the hit along those boards by big Yuri Fisher, all 6'5", 225 of them. Behind the net, Holmstrom, who plays in the same Detroit team as Fisher. Works it around Zidlitsky. Back behind the net. Fisher gets it off those boards. Kept in by Matthias Olin to the corner again. Holmstrom looking. Played it off the boards. Paulson was trying to keep it in play. Instead, it rolls over. Eliash attempted breakout pass for his former devil linemate Sikora. Instead, it goes off the boards. Sikora getting it back from Reichel. Back out, quick shot by Eliash. He partially fans. It goes in behind the net. Fast-paced opening period. Under 12 minutes to go in it. Held up there on the far side by Oland. Backhands it in. Both teams making changes. You might think that Sweden will change more often tonight. They played last night. The Czech Republic was idle. Here's a long shot by Lindstrom. It stopped in front and poked to the corner. Flipped along those boards. Lidstrom fakes the big shot. Played it in front, and it's deflected. Alfred's into the corner. Banged along the boards. Modine after a two. The lightning left winger plays it behind the net. Taking the puck away from him. Crowd loves him here like they do Forsberg. Those two got the biggest ovation at the start of the night. That was really good work by the Czechs, though. Sundin is so tough to play against. He had no chance to walk out in front of the net the way he wanted to. Vlasic in the corner. Broken up there. Out at the left point. Quick shot redirected over the top. Near boards, Czech Republic with Vlasic keeping it alive there. Luchinsky holds. Plays it in front. Shot was wide by Caberle, who was joining the play. Banged off those boards. Czech Republic coming back. Sweden with a quick change there. Nordstrom gets it. Far boards. Snapped into the zone. That one is whistled down. ESPN 2 is your ticket to more great World Cup hockey. Coming your way tonight and tomorrow night. Tonight at 7 p.m. Team Canada looks to go to 2-0 as they face off against Pavel Dimitra and Slovakia. And tomorrow, Team USA tries to rebound from their tough loss to the Canadians against Alex Kovalov, Alexei Yashin, and the rest of Team Russia. Also coming your way at 7 p.m. Eastern at Team Toyota. World Cup of Hockey right here on ESPN and ESPN 2. And from all reports, what a game that was. Brian Engblom last night with the USA and Canada. Oh, physical. yeah. And, and all the players here, they want to know, you know, they're asking us questions what happened what happened they didn't get a chance to see it most of them here some of the Swedish players were able to watch a little of the Canada US game but uh, most of the other guys couldn't they want to know everything that happened what kind of details we had great stuff from what we heard and uh, Canada with their first win in the tournament Sweden in this game out shooting the Czechs eight to seven Zetterberg nice cut inside oh. what a move but it was stopped oh Zetterberg a great move on goal Forsberg gets it back Forsberg holds it in traffic, kept in there by Nordstrom at the point. Forsberg looking for it. It comes out to the right point. Ragnarsson keeps it alive, working it around the boards. Forsberg takes the hit there. Caberlet's over there after it. It hops in front of the slot. Cleared out to the left boards and then sent down ice. All the way down ice by the Czech Republic. It would have been icing. Helkvist got it waved off. Oh, the, after the big line is really going for Sweden. It's as if because the Sundin line carried them last night, the, the Forsberg, Nassel, and Zetterberg line sort of backed off. It just sort of worked on their timing last night. That's the way it appeared. Now they're ready to carry the load, and they are right here. Telfer stopping that shot from the point. Jonsson chased by Jager, left for Ragnarsson. A giveaway there. Quick shot redirected wide off Jager's stick. 
Strakel after it. Now it is Yager looking for Straka. Prosper there too. Marty Straka coming out. Couldn't get a shot off. Looks to play it out to the point. Back for Straka. Left circle block. He's plowed over there by Olin. A quick shot off Yager. And now breaking out of the pack. Axelson over the line. Takes the wrister wide of Okun. Looked like it handcuffed him. Along the far boards, the Czech Republic will just be content to ice it on the next touch. We'll have the icing call. Ice. Breaking the action, great opening period, although we haven't seen a goal yet between Sweden and the Czech Republic.